For a one-off ITV documentary, Camilla's Country Life, the Duchess of Cornwall met with her sister Annabel Elliot to return to their childhood home, Hull Place, which was owned by their grandparents. As they were given a tour by new owner Michael Landon, Annabel admitted both she and Camilla were so sad they could not keep the home in the family. Camilla grew up in Hull Place, a 12-bedroom house in Hampshire which was owned by her grandparents. ITV viewers were told, Camilla grew up in a close-knit family, they prepared her well for whatever life was going to throw at her. Her wealthy family background meant there would never be financial worries. Royal biographer Angela Levine added, she was left half a million by her grandparents and so she didn't have to worry about making a living. Unfortunately, Camilla and Annabelle were not able to take over care of Hall Place. The Duchess sister told current owner Michael, there was a whole discussion about whether any of us would be able to take it on but the house was too big. I'd already been in Dorset for quite a long time and Camilla was in Wiltshire but we felt so sad about it going out of the family. Just moments later in the documentary, Camilla is seen pulling up to the family home where she reunites with Annabelle. The pair step back into their childhood as the Duchess exclaims, it's so strange being back here. We haven't been here since 1987. It's lovely to be here. It really is memory lane. As she reminisced about their childhood, the Duchess stated, I could find my way around here with my eyes shut. The two sisters recall rolling down the hills, catching butterflies, dressing correctly for their strict grandmother and which of the furnishings they each now have in their respective homes. Annabelle went on to reveal her beloved teddy bear was once buried in the garden by Camilla, who only owned up to it decades later. The Duchess confessed, My sister and I had had a bit of an argument so I buried him, it was sibling rivalry. Yes, teddy bar, he had a very happy resting ground, in the rose garden. When asked if she'd forgiven her sister, Annabelle laughed. Certainly not. No it still rankles to this day. In other parts of the documentary, Camilla spoke about tackling sensitive issues such as knife crime and domestic abuse. She commented, the countryside is not all roses, there are darker things happening. So anything I can do to help, it's been a taboo subject for too long. The royal also admitted it was hard to write an article about Prince Charles for Country Life magazine, it's not easy to write about your husband. I bit through several pencils. Camilla's Country Life is available to stream on ITV Hub now.